Praise the Lord. My name is uh, Paul Sontimutejereze. I serve at All Saints Cathedral. And what a great day for us to join our family uh, TV, Church of Uganda Family TV, for our sharing. In this week, we are going to specifically share from uh, the story of Joseph in the Bible. And I'm very sure quite a number of us are familiar with this, the story of Joseph in the Bible. And I pray that we each will find inspiration as uh, we do the sharing from the story of Joseph. And I'll center it on the subject, God's presence, our greatest resource. God's presence, our greatest resource. Everyone wakes up one morning, every morning, and they're saying, how am I going to make this day meaningful? Or how am I going to make my life meaningful? And I want to say to us that the greatest resource that we need in making our life meaningful is the presence of God. And we see this in the life of Joseph. Uh, first, as we look at this, Joseph want to look at Genesis chapter 39. Genesis chapter 39. So Joseph starts as a young man that has great inspirations, has great dreams of being a great leader and a great person. Unfortunately, Joseph's dreams did not come to be to, to reality at the beginning of his life. And the dreamer that we see in Joseph actually ends up being a slave. And in Genesis chapter 39, he is a slave in the house, in the home of Potiphar. And within Potiphar's home, the Bible tells us in Genesis chapter 39, verse 2, verse 2, that the Lord was with Joseph so that he prospered and he lived in the house of his Egyptian master, his master, Potiphar. The Lord was with Joseph so that he prospered. The greatest resource you and I need is God being with us. Because God was with Joseph, he prospered in everything he did as a houseboy in Potiphar's house. Can you imagine? He had lost his dreams. His brothers had sold him. Circumstances had pulled him down. But because God was with Joseph, he prospered. Dear friend, I want to say to you, as long as the Lord is with you, God is with me, God is with us. As long as God is with the nation of Uganda, the Lord being with the church of Christ in Uganda, no matter the circumstances and the strife that you'll face, the hardships that you face, the temptations that you'll face, we will prosper for as long as the Lord is with us. The Lord was with Joseph as a houseboy in Potiphar's house, Genesis chapter 39, verse 2 tells us, The Lord was with Joseph so that he prospered, and he lived in the house of his Egyptian master. We are told that Joseph found favor in the eyes of the master. Why? Because the Lord was with him. When God is with you, you find favor before people. Favor before people comes from God. Before those that you serve, before those that you serve with, some of us are, are marketeers of different products, of different goods, of businesses. When you have the favor of the Lord, you have the favor of the people. Verse 5 tells us, From the time he put him in charge of his household and all that he owned, the Lord blessed the household of the Egyptian master because of Joseph. Praise the Lord. This master was blessed because of Joseph. Father, it is my prayer that your favor will be upon each of these your children that are listening in. Like it was for Joseph that even in the tough circumstances there is evidence of you, of your power at work in our lives. In the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen.